switching industries is something many executives desire and are are timid about. They tell themselves, well, I don't think I have the network that would allow me to do it, or even more, I don't have the transferable skills. So how do you help an employer, a potential employer, see that you in fact have those skills? How do you demonstrate it? How do you market yourself, in other words, into a new industry? And a lot of it we find is there are way more transferable skills than people even think about. And there's very large umbrellas of where you can go to make a difference. So it is working with a career coach and looking at exactly what you have done. What are those transferable skills? For instance, if you're in a highly regulated industry, maybe you're in a division of healthcare and you want to get out of healthcare, but you've worked in a highly regulated industry and you understand that that's a good pivot point into another industry where somebody might see your value that you can transfer it in that way. So it is transferable. It is the way you present yourself and what you're looking for. That's why when we work with folks on their collateral, we talk about, well, where do you want to go next? And then we'll work on the collateral geared towards highlighting your value and the why you in that role. Mm -hmm. So if you know it, and now sometimes, Yes, it will take extra training. If you really want to change your careers, totally. It might take some extra work once you know which direction you want to go in. But I would say there's a lot more pivoting than you might be thinking that you're able to do. And employers are looking more out of the box. And it should bring you all some relief that it does come down to the value and the why you. And not that you didn't know one kind of system or you never worked in this field before. That if you know how to articulate the why you, you can make those changes. But it's when, you know, knowledge is power, even about yourself. And I, I find many executives are very timid about that. Well, I've been doing this for 30 years. I can't ever get out of it. That's not true. I work with many people who change careers all the time. And we see transitions from the military into the corporate world. You know, those folks are like, what am I gonna do? And you know what? Those are great transferable skills that people really value. 